sometimes that camera can be kind of hairy. Kind of mess around with it for a little while. So my old stool here. I call it my YouTube stool. Or my Facebook stool. Stool of vision. YouTube stool of vision. Alrighty. I'm going to wish, I'm not a father, I've never been married, and I've never had children, but I just thought I'd wish all you fathers out there a happy Father's Day. I hope you guys, have, it's, it's not easy trying to be a father. Being a father is a, is, is a, is, is, is a hard task, you know, once somebody has a baby and stuff and they raise them trying to raise them the right way and make sure they go on the right path and make sure they do the right thing and discipline them when they need to be. Spoil. You don't want to spoil your kid, you just want to keep it this right. Being a dad is not easy and I want to wish all you dads out there happy Father's Day. And uh, I'm so I'm so proud of you. You know, I'm not a, uh, like I said, I'm not a dad. The chances are I probably never will be a dad. Probably will never have kids. I mean, I'm 40 years old. I've never had, never gotten married. There's, there's a reason why I'm not never gotten married, and and the reason why is that's not what God wanted me to do. And uh, but uh, anyway, so all you fathers out there, I want to wish you a happy Father's Day and many many Father's Day to come. Father's days to come, and I just hope your kids are are well behaved. And I mean, God bless you, and everything's going to be great. And, you know, this is a real dad, a dad that watches over the kids. You don't spoil them, but you get them things every once in a while. A dad, a good dad, is a dad. If they're they tell their son or daughter not to cross the street, and they do it anyway. When they told them not to, they discipline them, and they make sure they let them know that. You know, me personally, when I was raised as a child, I was spanked. And if I did something wrong, for instance, if I yelled at my mom and dad, or I called them something late, I shouldn't have. Or I was smart to them, or back talk. Ooh, they was, or I'd lie to them. They would spank them, spank them. They'd give me three. Three spanks with a with a buck belt. You know, they weren't they weren't torturing me. They weren't abusing me. That's just the way that's just the way I was raised. Some people are raised getting spanked. Some people are. But the point I'm trying to make is being a dad is not easy, and you got to make all the right choices. So that child, when they get older, they'll make all the right decisions. You know, I was raised about as perfectly perfect as you could come. My parents were perfect. I, if I were to give them a rating from 1 to 10, I'd give them a 12. They were that good. They they loved me so much. They loved me so much. When I was a kid, when I was young, I used to call my dad uh, Papa Smurf. Because he was, not because he looked like Pop, Papa Smurf, because he was just right there on top every time I needed him. Never did complain about anything I did that was just out of the ordinary. The only thing, only time he'd complain is if I were making him upset. And I don't blame him. For instance, there was a time when I was younger. I was in fifth grade and I was, he was helping, you know, when your dad gets home at five o'clock, he's tired, he doesn't want to do anything, he wants to rest. And he was the kind of dad that would. sit down with you at six o'clock at night after dinner and he'd help you with your homework. Well he helped me with my homework and I was such a smart aleck and I didn't want to do it. It was I was studying for a spelling spelling test and I got smart smart to him and I back talked to him to the point where he just took me in the back and he just spanked me with four four spanks of a sword with a belt. And who else out there gets spanked? I know some of you guys probably don't believe in get spanked, but here if I had kids, I would spank them. I wouldn't abuse them. I would spank them. Three, three, three spanks of this with a with a with a with a bell. That's the, that's the way I'd go. That's it.
So three cheers to the dad, out dads out there, and God bless them. And I hope everything co goes just the way you want, them, want it to as your children get older, girls and boys alike. So y'all have a nice night, and I'm going to post this up soon. Before the end of the night, right? Hope so, because this is Father's Day. We want all the fathers to watch it.